Well, grade twos, today is our final spelling lesson together. You guys have been working so hard and improved your spelling so much over the course of grade two. Great job. There is something a little special at the end um, when you finish your final spelling test this week that there's a special certificate inside your package that you can ask your mom or dad for. So for our last spelling, we're gonna work with the red tiles. Do you remember what our red tiles are called? They are our vowels, you're correct. Now vowels, we learned that they have short sounds and they also have long sounds. So let's review the sounds. You say them out loud and then I'll say them. A, A. E, E. I. I. O, O. U, U. Very good. So the first is our short. And the second was our long sound. So let's review the long sounds. It's the name of the vowel. A, E, I, O, U. Very good. Now I'm going to build the word shed. Sh, ed. Sh, ed. Okay. Is there a letter after the vowel here? Yes, there is. So we would label it a closed syllable because the vowel is closed in by the letter D. So when it's closed in, the vowel says it's short sound, eh. Okay? Now, if I take away the D, okay, is there anything after the E now? No. So it's going to become a open. It's open at the end. So it's going to have the long sounder. It's going to say its name, sh, e. So now we have the word she, exactly, okay? So I'm gonna build a word and you tell me if it is open or closed. Okay, is that open or closed? He, it's open, there's nothing after the N, so it's gonna say E, he. This one? You said closed, you're right. The M closes it in. So it's going to say eh, huh, M, hem, like I'm going to hem your pants. Okay. Let's do this one. Open or closed? Open. So it says its name. So, so, like so, are we going to go for ice cream now? The next one, is this open or closed? Closed in, right? The CK comes so it's s -aw. sock. Sock. Very good. And let's do this one. Open or closed? Closed in. The O is closed in by the T, so it's going to say ah. G ought. Very good. Well done. Okay? So the vowel in a closed syllable is short. The vowel in an open syllable is usually long. It's going to say its name. Now, there's a couple interesting situations that I'm going to build here. I'm going to build the word them. Okay? So this word says them. Okay? Now, if I take away the M, it becomes an open, it should say the E, the. Now we say it, the, right? So the E, this is a special situation where the E's doesn't sound. So when you spell the word the, it's T-H-E, even though it sounds like a U, okay? The, very good. The other thing, if I spell this word, like I have a cat, okay? We usually say a, I have a cat, or I have a cat when we speak, okay? So those are some practice. Now we're going to get our spelling book out and we are going to get ready to dictate your words that you are going to practice this week. So open up to the next page and I want you to write step 24. It's the final step of our grade two spelling. And remember our red margin, we're going to write our number on this side and our word on this side and we'll skip a line each time. Okay, so you get your spelling book all ready. We're going to get ready for our 
first word here. And our first word is she. Our second word is we. Third word, so. It was so windy, my hat blew off. Fourth word, a. I have a cat. Or I have a cat. He. The fifth word is he. Sixth word, the. Seventh word, no. Eighth word, me. Ninth word, B. The dessert will be good tonight. And your tenth word, go. Okay, so you're going to get your list from your package. You're going to go through, check an X. Remember, don't erase. So then you know the ones you need to practice. And this week, you're going to write your words twice, as well as your mom or dad have some phrases and some sentences. Okay, so we're going to move from just phrases. Remember, we didn't do a capital or a period. But now when we do sentences, we want to start with a capital and we want to end with a period. And when you get finished this week after your spelling test on Friday, there is a special certificate for you for all of your hard work and completing grade two spelling. Well done, boys and girls.